Europe's top club competition is back ahead of UEFA Champions League last 16 action this week. We look at teams. Heavyweight collides in Paris. P PSG, Paris Saint-Germain and Bayern Munich meet this week in Ari. Collision between two teams with expectations to go far. Each disappointed last season with PSG suffered, suffering a comeback defeat to eventual winners Rio Madrid at this stage and Bayern Munich upset by Villarreal in the last eight. PSG have breezed into the knockout rounds this season but ended up as runner-ups in the Group H after a remarkable turn of events. Benfica's 6-1 slashing of Maccabi Haifa on March day 6 saw the Portuguese of a host PSG on way on away goals squad after the two teams finished level on points head-to-head -head meetings, goal difference and goal squad. PSG now face a difficult last 16 tie with Bayern in a rematch of the 2020, 2020 final when the Bundesliga giants extended the French side weight for European success. The Parisians have the star power to trouble any side in the world football and the return of Kylian Mbappe, Hamstring and Lionel Messi Masichura issue to training is a major positive ahead of Tuesday's clash. Christoph Galitzi's side entered the World Cup break and beaten, but have lost four times in all competitions in 2023 already. Another loss at the Parc de Prince this weekend will leave PSG facing a few tasks to reach the last eight. Faltering form makes Milan vs Tottenham Hotspurs fascinating. AC Milan and Tottenham meet in the Champions League this week, with each team resuming their European campaign amid faltering domestic form. Milan, after a two Champions League knockout rounds for the first time since 2013-2014, having progressed as runner-up to Chelsea in Group E despite convincing defeats home and away to the Premier League side. Therefore, heading into a shutdown with Tottenham Hotspurs could hardly have been worse. Milan lost four games in a row in all competitions, including heavy losses to Lazio, 4-0, so 5-2 and Inter Milan City to nil before a win over Torino at the weekend stopped the lot. Meanwhile, Antonio Conte will be looking for Spurs to bounce back after a 4-1 flashing at Resta City. Tottenham Hot Spurs have now lost 7 of their last 13 league games a run which has seen the North Londoners drop out of Premier League top four. New signings Pedro Poro and you had a nightmare debut at Resta. While Rodrigo Betancourt's season ending knee injury represents a huge bow with the Uruguayan having been one of the few consistent performers in the contest side this season. Milan's exciting left-sided acts of Theo Hernandez and Rafael Roy will look to exploit the weakness down the Spurs' right after Leicester's Harvey Barnes gave Poro and Jafet Tanganga a third time last weekend. A Benfica Dark Horses Napoli's form this season has seen the Italian side dubbed as dark horse for Champions League success this season, with Luciano Spalletti's side 
cruising into the knockout round after thrashing Liverpool, Ajax and Rangers in the group stage. The Serie A reader have impressed to earn the tag, that tag, but Benfica have quietly enjoyed a fine season of their own, having topped a group containing PSG and Juventus without losing a game. Roger Schmidt have been handed a favorable Rat 16 tie against the surprising package Club Bridge. Club Bridge have become just the second Belgium side to reach this stage in Champions League era, and Benfica will be begin as favorites. The Portuguese side have lost just once in seven games across all competition this season, from which has been Benfica create a five point lead over Porto in the Pre- Premier League. Their 20 league games have seen just 12 goals conquered while home and away wins over Juventus and draw with PSG have shown their ability to mix in to mix it in Europe. Even given the loss of Enzo Fernandez to Chelsea last month, Benfica will be confident of reaching the last eight ahead of their first leg with Bridge in Belgium. The quarterfinals in is then a stage where almost anything feels feel possible. Hellas prepares for Champions League return. Borussia Dortmund will host Chelsea in it. Champions League this week, a first ever meeting between the teams in European competition. In the Bundesliga side, the ranks will be Sebastian Haller, who will be preparing for his first appearance in Champions League since March 2022. Last season, the Ivorian took the competition for st- by storm, scoring four goals on his competition debut against Sporting Lisbon and 11 times in just 8 matches for Ajax. That form persuaded Dortmund to spend £34.5 million pounds to sign Holler as their current replacement before the diagnosis of testicular cancer just weeks after signing for the club put the forwards career on hold. After two surgeries and the full cycle of chemotherapy, Hora made his return for the Dortmund last month before scoring his first competitive goal for the club against Feyberg on February the 6th. It has been a remarkable tally of strengths in a diversity for Hara, who will be reminded how far he's come with the Champions League anthem plays out of the West Farley Stadium, how Dortmund will be glad to have her back with only three of the qualified teams having scored less than their 10 goals in group stage. Rich James and Chile were key to Chelsea's chances. Graham Potter this week discussed this ex- his excitement at the return of Champions League as the Chelsea manager prepares for his first experience at the knockout stages. Chelsea remain a work in progress and Potter's uncertainty over his best side and system have been evident, marking more, making more changes to his starting level than any other Premier League manager since taking a charge at Stamford Bridge. The wealth of new additions have added the talents, but also more selection problems for Potter as he looks to sharp to shape this Chelsea squad into a side capable of competing for prizes. One major boost is the replacement return of Rhys James and Ben Shirley from injury. They do have the potential to be one of the most effective wing-back partnership in, Premier, in Europa 
European football and can inject some much needed creativity into Chelsea side. The West Londoners have often dominated possession in European fixture this season, but have struggled to create chances with regularity. Given appearance for a back three in the Champions League and need for ammunition for a new look forward line, James and Chilwell could prove the difference as Chelsea take a Borussia Dortmund for a place in the last 18. 14 February 2023, PSG will play with Bayern Munich live from Parc des Princes, the home of PSG. In round of 16 first leg, another game will be AC Milan playing with Tottenham Hotspurs. Round of 16 first leg live from San Siro in Milan. Thank you very much for being with us. This is Asha Vista. The home of football. Let's enjoy Champions League on Valentine's Day. See you in other upcoming videos. We love you. And if you like, you can subscribe, comment, and share so that we can grow together in everything. Thank you.